Good evening. Today we wanted to do something a little bit different. This is the end of the day. Typically we work from about after lunch till we can't work anymore. But today was different. We knew we were gonna get thunderstorms in the afternoon, so we went ahead and got all of our work done before lunch, which is, that just never happens. But I wanted to show you what happens at the end of the day. So I've been in town for the last three hours getting planners. <laughs> I am determined for all of us to get on the same page so that the kids know what we're doing, we know what we're doing every week, and just, you know, get a little bit more organization in our lives. <laughs> we have a lot going on, and I just want to make sure everybody knows everybody's step. So we're not like, what are you doing today? What are you doing? Everybody knows what needs to get done and we are all just working together to make it happen. So I'm on my way home, should be there in just a few minutes, and we're gonna get the dogs out because it's about time for them to have their evening play session. However, we just got dumped on, like so much rain, it's gonna be a messy night. <laughs> so everybody's like, how do you keep your doodles clean? We don't. They're gonna have so much playtime tonight and they're, I'm sure that when I get home, there's puddles everywhere. I'm just expecting I'm gonna have to give them baths or at least rinse them completely down tonight in the outdoor shower, which is another great use for that. So let's get home, see what needs to be done. And uh, maybe I get to show the kids my planners. Everything is so green right now. Just about every night we're having some kind of rainstorm. It doesn't usually amount to much, but every little bit helps and it just makes everything pop with green and it's so beautiful right now. And it makes our road really rough, which I'm kind of thankful for because way too many people are speeding down this road. But uh, yeah, it, it does get rough. So uh, we're almost home. Cannot wait to see our swales. Also, I really wish that you could smell the desert. Sometimes I just drive with the window down because oh, it smells so, so good. If you have not smelled the desert after a rainstorm, you are really missing out. And I really hope it's something that you can experience at least once in your life, because it is something special. Sometime we really need to get that part of the driveway fixed <laughs> when we have time. When I pulled up, I saw that um, nobody took the towels off the clothesline before the rainstorm. So washing the dogs is gonna be tricky because we don't have extra towels. We have two for the dogs and now they're both soaked. Should be fun. Poor Cloud, he hates storms and he hates being wet. But I know a lot of you have said, where's all your dog houses? Why don't you have dog houses outside? That is a great way to attract snakes and a great place for snakes to hide. And I don't think he would use it even if we built it. We have a shelter that we left out for him from our old goat paddock area. He will not go in it. So I don't think he'll go in it. He usually goes under the airstream if it's raining a whole lot. Now, one thing we have tried with Cloud when we know a storm is coming in and it's like right before the storm is I try to get him over to the barn and he'll go in the paddock with Trona and that way he has access to the barn if he wants to stay dry. But it looks like maybe this just came on so fast that they didn't have time to do it. He's okay. He's an outdoor dog. He's fine.
but oh my gosh, it feels so nice. It cools down so much out here after a rain. Smells amazing, looks beautiful, love it. I know sooner or later it will come The day that I know I'm in love Will it feel warm and dry Like a kiss in July Will it chill down my bones Will it cool like the snow And I look at my window to see what the universe has in store for me People passing by in the street Will be smiling at me Cause they already know What is it like being in love The sky starts to roll up its clouds So the sun can just stop hiding out Still looking blue Don't know who you are yet You seem a bit hard to get But I know you're out there I just wait for the day where You guys wanna go to the puddle? The sky will spread open its clouds So the sun can just stop hiding out the windows will open and sing Like birds that are spreading the wings And I spot you right across the street Like a song that is playing just for me We'll know and we'll smile as if we are new this time I was waiting for you For those of you who don't know, we are having some issues with Cloud since we got him last summer from a friend. He came in three years old and um, he was fine for the first couple months, but then he started attacking Mojito. Uh, him and Ocho worked it out to be who's boss, but um, him and Mo are just, uh, we, we can't figure it out, but he is after Mo a lot. So that's why you haven't seen the doodles out as much because when the doodles are out, Cloud has to be on leash or it's just been chaotic. Now we have been working with our friend Brittany and she's helping us like reintroduce him to the pack, but it's still um, touch and go. So we just have to keep a close eye and make sure that Mo doesn't get hurt and make sure Cloud plays nice. Yeah, we 
got our limb shoes in, so we need to open those tonight. Finally? Yeah. Finally. Yeah. Jax has shoes, Adelaide has shoes, I have shoes. I've been waiting. Me and Adelaide have been eagerly waiting. <laughs> Ocho, be nice. Ocho, no. Ocho, no shoes for you. He's like, no thanks. <laughs> I got it. Ocho, Mo, Trona, you guys want to go to a different puddle? <gasps> Do you want to go to another puddle? Let's go. Come on. Let's go. Come on. One thing that we need to do is set up a paddock for the goats using our electric netting. We haven't got to rotate them to graze yet, but this would be a great time to do it. After it rains, it's a lot easier to get those stakes in the ground. So that's what we're gonna do now. Well, first, Jet really wants to open his shoes because they're waterproof shoes and he wants to wear them to where he can be in the grass and not be wet. <laughs> oh, Joe. So many shoes. I'm so excited. I'm Which ones are yours? Chelsea boot. Jack got the waterproof Chelsea boot. I hope they fit. I do too. I was going to get these, but then I changed my mind last minute and got the same kind that I like have. Oh, those are nice. Yeah, I think those will fit. Those look big enough. Yeah. That's great. I love limbs. We love limbs because they are barefoot shoes and they're just so comfortable. It's not a shoe that you have to like wear in. They just are super comfortable from the moment you open the box. Like they're so great. We wear them all the time. And this is a new pair for Jet. I want to know how like this works. Yeah, like, I, I didn't get them because I didn't know if my foot would fit in it. Surely it will. Yeah, do you actually want to try one of these on? See? Maybe after you. Those look nice. Are they too big? They look big. Nope. It's like right there. It's just big on your ankle. That's nice. Oh, thanks. No, that's fine. Those are nice because they can just slip them on and get them off. Yeah, it's like a work, easy work boot. Yeah. Mm -hmm. nice. It's really nice. I mean, I might try them. I think it would fit your ankle a little bit snugger. This is why I needed new shoes. I've worn them. <laughs> every day for a year also if anybody knows where to find socks that don't do this that within six months every pair of socks is ruined okay anyway i'm gonna try these on oh dang it i should have got these <laughs> these are so nice i told you i should have got them next time next time i need boots i'll get them next year now, I just got the same kind of shoes that I always wear because I am afraid of change. So, look how nice. Look at comparison. <laughs> One year old, new. <laughs> I'm excited to have a nice pair of boots. And not only did I get a pair of work boots, I also got a pair of like shoes to wear into town because all I have is work boots and flip flops and sometimes I don't want to wear flip flops. So, look at this. These are their Laguna. This is why we love barefoot shoes, because you can do this. Like, if my shoe can't do that, I can't wear it. Anyway, I'm excited to try this. Those are like having a slipper on. 
if I could get a pair of jeans, these would look so good, right? Okay. It's like wearing slippers. That's nice. That looks good. All right, Jax and Adelaide are gonna have to open their shoes in a little bit because we need to go get that fence put up while the ground is still soaking wet. I don't know if I ever showed you guys this. We put up this little shade structure. Boom sent us some shade cloth material and made this little structure for the goats and they don't use it. Why do we bother? You ready to do this? You know how you want it? Yeah. Building a paddock this way in the corner so so we'll take this and move it over there, open this and let them come in. Okay, it's a good plan. You're so smart. is done so we need Adelai and Jax to open their shoes make sure they fit Jax it's time to go open your shoes and see if they fit yay they look really cool I might have sneaked a peek yay mom I was just trying to find it <laughs> alright let's see Ooh. look at that nice those were the primal zen. Oh yeah. <laughs> Alright, let's see if they fit. How do they fit? Are Pretty they too well. small or too big? I think they're good. Nice. They look nice. You like them? Mm -hmm. See. What do you think? I like them. Comfy? The right size? Thank you. 
Sometimes when the sunset or sunrise is super pretty, I just come out to the house and try to imagine what it's gonna look like when you're peeking out the windows. Look at this view. One thing that we were planning on doing tonight, but we didn't get around to it, is working on more of the vapor barrier and hardware cloths, but that will have to happen tomorrow because we're tired. It's been a long day, productive day, but it's time to just enjoy the rest of the evening and be done. I just remembered we have to give the dogs baths. Great. We'll find you in the morning Sunlight draped across your face You are smiling from the moment The breath within your lungs escapes You say someday we will wake up And the memories will all but fade But in this moment we're together Nothing can erase this day